What's up, the John Squad? And welcome to this Monday weekly episode of John's <clears throat> Thoughts episode 77. Woo! That's right, we're in episode 77. So let's get things going, shall we? We're going to start off with the first news that happened during the week. New York Mets promote Tim Tebow to... To high A ball. That's pretty amazing. To high A ball. That's just awesome. I'm so proud for Tim Tebow, man. He's like a class act, and I like him a lot. He's just one of those guys I look up to too in um for professional sports. So that's right, Tim Tebow. We're all gonna be Tebowing when he makes it to the majors. I hope. So now another news. Uh, Dirk Nowitzki's contract option, this line by Mavericks, will sign a new. Dallas Mavericks deal. So that's pretty good for Dirk Nowinski. I think he's going to get a new deal with the Dallas Mavericks. So that's pretty good for Dirk. I love Dirk Nowinski. He's a great ball player. Great enthusiast. Really excited for him. I'm so proud for the guy. Uh, let's see. Hornets GM introduces Dwayne Bacon as Dwayne Wade by mistake. Uh... It happens, man. Getting confused with Dwayne Wade, Dwayne Bacon. Uh... Man, it's just hilarious how the way he did it. Oh, man. Hilarious stuff right there. Hilarious. Just, I hope you all got a laugh out of that one because he introduces Dwayne Bacon as Dwayne Wade. Oh, man, this is so funny. So, Hornets Jam. Uh, Dwayne Wade. Uh, okay, I hope you all got a good laugh out of that one. Uh, Conor McGregor will knock out Floyd Mayweather in so inside you know inside the cage or something for 35 and 35 seconds says tyson furry yeah right i doubt like that's gonna happen in real life man conor mcgregor and knock out floyd mayweather heck no we'll just wait and see what's gonna happen can't wait to see that fight uh Apparently, uh, Ivanka Trump says she tries to stay away from politics. You know what? That's really good for her. I'm glad she stays away from politics because that's what I do, too. So, that's pretty good for her. Uh, Nick Farley out for 2017. Uh, this is such a sad one, too. Nick Farley out for 2017 with heart conditions. Career could be over. Very sad for the guy, but, you know... Hopefully all goes well for this kid, man. Just hoping for the best for him. Uh, apparently, uh, Tom Brady voted league's top player by the peer, by peers. So, I guess Tom Brady got voted by his peers. So, I guess that's pretty good. Tom Brady voted league's top player by peers. Okay, then. That's something new. I guess Tom Brady gets voted, I guess. So, on to the next one. Uh, Russell Westbrook. Wins MVP, Most Valuable Player, in, during the 2017 NBA Awards. How awesome is that? Woo, Russell Westbrook. Man, people say he no deserves it. I think he does, but still, Russell Westbrook is just awesome. I don't love him to play for the Celtics, but still, that's just awesome. Uh, apparently, uh, last Monday on Raw, uh, LeVar Ball loses his shirt on WWE Monday Night Raw. Last Monday, and I just thought it was so hilarious, too, man. It was just a cringeworthy segment. Like, LeVar Ball should never be in a WWE ring. He just should never be in a WWE ring, period. But it was just an hilarious segment and stuff like that. Like, this is my thoughts about it, and I just thought that it was just hilarious, and it was just like, ugh, and then the Dean Ambrose comes walking out, and I was like, thank God, and Dean Ambrose had that smile on his face, so that's pretty good, though. Glad he saved the segment, at least Dean Ambrose, it was going nowhere in that segment on Miz TV, so that's a good thing, and apparently, uh, Charlie, Sh Charlie Sheen puts Babe Ruth's 1927 World Series ring up for auction. Hey, maybe I'll go purchase it for auction. Babe Ruth's 1927 ring. Maybe I'll go do that right now. Let's see. Let, let me get out my wallet. Let me go get, grab my money. I'm just joking. I'm not going to purchase I'm not that rich. But still, anyway, just decided to make you guys laugh on a Monday morning. So, uh, 
Yeah, and also the last news of the day, uh, we had uh, during the week that happened, uh, Chris Paul of the LA Clippers got traded to the Houston Rockets for, I don't I forgot who the players they traded for, the Rockets traded for, but still, that's only good news right there for Chris Paul, now he's on the Houston Rockets with James Harden, so... That about this here for John's Thoughts, episode 77. Once again, the John Squad, please like this video, leave your comments down below, and subscribe for more. You're all the best, the John Squad. I say it every day. You're one of a kind, and just stay positive today. Stay positive. Keep your head up. It's 4th of July tomorrow. May the 4th be with you on 4th of July, and that's right, just... Oh. Oops, I just made a mistake. Well, it's still the fourth, but I keep forgetting that we're not. It's, we're not in May. We're in July, but still. Anyway, make make Fourth of July your time, and hope you all have a wonderful Fourth of July tomorrow. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. My daily Monday Night Raw review. Once again, the John Squad. Please like this video, leave your comments down below, and subscribe for more. You're all the best, the John Squad. You're one of a kind. <sighs> Peace.